right guys so i am back from lidl and um did really well with lidl i'm really impressed this is my second time going um lidl did reach out to me i don't know if i'm gonna group this with a vlog or just by itself i did they did reach out to me they saw my post on instagram and she was so nice they sent me a 50 dollars gift card and so i was gonna go back to lidl anyway because we have some favorites sorry if you hear some Josiah. But I really enjoyed it. So I'm going to try to tell you guys the prices. It was so much I wanted to get. But I was on a um, budget. And still I spent a total of um, $94. So I was trying to get up under that. And I was kind of trying to get some things to cook for myself that was healthy. Um, things that they want. And Thanksgiving stuff. So I would have had to probably spend about two, 200 and something to really get everything. But anyway, um, I let me, let's just go over the haul. So I picked up some bananas. Um, these were 99 cents. They do have a machine that will weigh it and it will print out the ticket for you. I don't know if that's just loose bananas or what, but um, I did it anyway and it was already done for her. Um, Josiah kept saying pizza mama pizza. We picked these up last time. The pepperoni, they were special that week for 99 cents. The pepperoni and JJ said that he actually thought that they were better than um, Aldi. That week they were 99 cents, just the pepperoni. This week um, I picked up the four meat. I picked up two of them. They are $1.99 at Aldi. They are $2.29 I believe. $1.99 and Saya kept saying pizza mama pizza so sometimes he'll throw stuff in my buggy or throw evidently throw it out and he threw out the other pizza so I only have one pizza and that's just a snack for them um everybody probably won't even we can everybody can share this but so I'm a little disappointed in that I needed some iodized salt this was 35 cent um don't buy it often and I needed some of that. We still had syrup, but I picked it up anyway. It was $1.45. The pasta sauce, they have traditional and mushroom there. They also have an organic, but this pasta particular sauce is 85 cents. Um, the pancake and waffle mix, buttermilk, and they have the original. I don't know what this tastes like. I was gonna get this last time, changed my mind. It's $1.49. Um, I saw this also last time, the raspberry lemonade, wanted to try it. I do love Aldi's, so I just wanted to try it. It was $1.79. Two bell peppers, they were $0.49, cents. and the red sealess grapes were $0.99 cents a pound. The pepperoni slices, I think, are $1.69. It's a really good price. $1.95. For the pepperoni slices, last time I accidentally picked up the pepper, um, the turkey, and they were okay. Um, yeah, I love their bread. I like the honey wheat, and then it's cheaper. Like it's a dollar forty nine at Aldi. Um, I think even Walmart's is a little bit um, about the same or a little bit more. I think it's a tad bit more, almost two dollars at all. Um, Walmart. This bread I really like. They're going to have sandwiches today, Saturday. I'm not cooking. And so I picked up four. I wanted to pick up maybe six and freeze them or five. Um, they're 85 cents a piece. I picked up the colas just because they're 49 or 55 cents or something like that. Um, picked up two of those. Yeah, they're 55 cents. And I got the liter so that I won't be tempted to get the cherry coat, which was $3.29, which was a great price, which... I really like and I have to um, tell myself not to drink that. Um, the sour cream and cheddar flavor potato chips. Um, they like these. These were a dollar. No, these are 89 cents, guys. And these are good. Um, the potato chips barbecue were 79 cents. I think the chips at Aldi are like one something. Right at one. The mozzarella cheese, I did have several recipes for mozzarella cheese, but I put one back. This is the 2% milk reduced fat. It's $1.89 and the Italian blend, um, fancy shredded cheese. And I'm gonna make, um, I'll just tell you in a second cause I'm like trying to remember prices and having brain farts and stuff. Um, oh, I hope this deducted. 
because I did put in, um, they do have some coupons, Lidl does, and you have to put in, I think, your phone number, um, and then it'll bring up your loyalty coupon, whatever you clip. Usually, they don't have no more than six coupons, and I guess it's linked to your phone number, and I just completely forgot to ask her if it came off. I'll check in one second. But the Lean Ham, last time I tried the Dell um, Variety Pack, and this time, just the Lean Ham smoke because they didn't have the variety pack with the smoke. And my family seemed like they grabbed, of course, the ham first. But this is only like $3.15, guys. Yeah, so it was $3.15. I was trying to look on my receipt. And I did say $0.50 cents off of this. So it was $3.15, $0.50 off of that. The broccoli um, with cheese sauce, I used to get something similar to this all the time. Um, I think it was Green Giant when I used to coupon a lot in the little box. And those were one fifteen each. So I picked up two of those. JJ seems like he eats it, um, his vegetables better or broccoli better with um, sauce. He will eat it without it. Um, I also picked up some chopped spinach. And the bag looked like it was a lot. It's still a lot. Um, and I picked up some cream cheese over there to make some cream spinach mama gave me that idea because i was like oh i didn't think about that um <laughs> then i picked up some um boneless chicken wings i don't know what this tastes like guys this is honey barbecue sauce also hot wings i saw in their flyer that this was only like 2.59 i hope it's good i did ask someone next to me if they tried it i noticed in the freezer which i do anywhere i go i notice what's less in the case or on the shelf and it's sometimes or most of the time i would say 75 percent of the time it's a good indication what is probably better and the buffalo wings was had less than these but i know my husband loves honey barbecue so i wanted to try these i'm hoping that it doesn't have that um it tastes like um I don't know. Um, the processed meat too much. I know it's processed meat, but I just hope that it's, um, like it says, only white meat chicken. So I hope that it doesn't taste too processy, um, if that makes sense, because I don't like chicken like that. They don't seem to mind, but I don't. Um, hickory smoked bacon. Um, this was only like $3.09, guys. That was an awesome price. And the ground turkey was only $2.74. That's a really good price. I can't remember how much... All these is I want to say three something and I should have picked up um, another one because I was gonna make the zucchini boats um, still may don't know they did have larger um, family packs these are just shaped different than Aldi um, this is about the same size so it's like two six oh seven I do have to compare the net price the net weight price that it is at Aldi because seems like at Aldi it's closer to seven dollars um they did have like a 73 is it 73 70 27 um I didn't want to get that because it shrinks up and I just don't like a lot um seem like when it has a lot of fat it don't agree with me and I don't really want to feed that to them so I'll at least get the 80 20 I will get that but try not to I should have picked up two of these but I didn't I did also pick up a um bone and ham not the spiral but the bone and ham and it was 89 cents a pound and i wanted to see how much aldi's was but aldi for some reason on their app they are saying go to the store which the prices do vary per store but go to the store to find out the price and i was kind of frustrated with that because i wanted to see who which one was cheaper and i should have gotten the ham it was a large ham for the price um but i put it back and it was the last one so anyway, I picked up some jumbo buttermilk biscuit buttermilk biscuits. These were 69 cents. Usually I picked up two. I only picked up one. The other night, um, I did um, cook this for the boys. I made them biscuits, a fried egg, and I put some provolone cheese on it because that's all I had. And they liked it. And I liked it too. It was really good. Sometimes, actually, when I open up the one from Aldi, it has a funny smell. Um, but this was fresh. And um, I had it for two or three weeks but i had it in the freezer some sharp cheddar cheese i needed some more ibuprofen i don't use this um everybody else can um mainly for Catrell because he said he sprained his wrist in the game to get the inflammation down american singles orange juice chocolate milk some baby wipes they were um 109 
I think the Sharp Cheddar Cheese was only $145, sorry. Ivory Profum was $199. This was $165 or $155, a great price. The orange juice was $159 and the milk was $175, I want to say, which is a little high because at Aldi it is $120 something. Also, guys, I wanted to stock up on all of their spices. Their garlic salt. Their garlic salt was $119, which is a great price for this size. This is a six ounce size and also I want to pick up some lemon pepper because I've been cooking lately if it's fish the lemon pepper um, this was 99 cents uh, also they had a lot of other I love their bottles um, I think they had pumpkin pie spice and rosemary and something else but I needed some poultry season and this was a dollar 99 for the turkey beat the crowd because I don't like on that spice out there in Thanksgiving and Christmas time I needed some more ground cumin all of these I love these bottles are 55 cents um Aldi doesn't have as much as variety in spices but I like that Lidl does um I did a little inventory of what I needed and it was still I needed some cinnamon but I said I just wait some parsley flakes I picked up some onion powder some garlic powder um, some black peppercorn grinder this was 119 and some oregano leaves they also had um, basil and basil leaves and I believe that was a little bit more the EVOO was 199 and the tomato ketchup I want to say was like 119 or something I want to say less than that it was actually 109 the tomato ketchup and they have another one that's like 85 cents also i picked up some chicken wings they were 350 um it their chicken wings look really um really big they're like one um 89 a pound great price i picked up the cream cheese it was only like 65 cents some hot italian sausage i can't remember how much this is 269 I did pick up some um, we went to the bakery I did get a picture I did of the bakery I'm not supposed to take pictures of Lita and um, so these were 45 cents each and I picked up three um, the hot wings here are the hot wings they were 259 the whole strawberries oh I'm trying to remember off of memory guys and I don't remember I used to remember stuff like the back of my hand um, the waffles I know is one 15 the potato fries were 155 the curly fries had a coupon this week but they were 199 and i just went with the potato fries the chicken um drumsticks were 379 for this pack it's a small pack but if i make it with the wings it'll be fine oh it was the whole strawberries i want to say they weren't even two dollars they were 175 and then lastly the purified water was 169 guys for a pack I don't know why I didn't get to and to say this super quick because my battery is blinking um, my car wouldn't start because I was out of water when we left and I was way I mean 30 minutes from a little bit less from home and I was like I had to call my husband and I didn't know what to do and um, it was like a guy came out of nowhere I asked another guy he didn't have jumper cables and he found someone else that had this big truck that looked like he worked for AAA or something and he um, helped mama and I and got the car going he said the other guy that I first flagged down said I needed water in my battery and he put water in my battery and he um, it was another guy he did, couldn't find the guy with the big truck, he couldn't find his jumper cables in his car because he had lots of tools. And the other guy, he had one. So anyway, they got me started and got me home. And they put water in the car. And um, yeah, but that's a great price. The spring water is $2.15. And I really enjoy Lidl. I will try my best to go down there more. Um, also, I want to try, I think it's Food for Less. Food for Less or... It's some other store that if I figure out what it is, I'll put it across the screen. Mom. But guys, thanks so much for watching. Thanks so much, Lidl. Um, if you're watching this video for reaching out to me, I really do appreciate when stores that I really enjoy, they reach out to me. Um, this is my own opinion and my um, true opinion, my honest opinion. A lot of companies reach out to me and I don't do it. 
but um we tried Lidl before they even reached out to me and we loved my family loved a lot of their stuff so i like them and also aldi of course you guys know i love aldi and um but uh if they Lidl wasn't so far i would go there all the time so i hope you guys bring one to our town but thanks so much again guys thanks so much for watching and i'll see you guys in the next video bye bye <music>